Welcome back heroes to some more Pokemon Taiseo. Last episode we defeated our rival, got the second medal and started making our way to the third town where the mine entrance is and the bandits tried taking us and they're like yo we want to get revenge on you and your friend. I guess it's just you so 2v2v1 two two in our favor and I was just like okay and then absolutely destroyed him. But welcome to the uh, Tanko mine. Make sure you wear a helmet. Uh, I don't have a helmet but my Maractus does. It has a rocky helmet so I mean I guess I'm somewhat safe. Well, Maractus is safe, so if I get in trouble, Maractus can save me. Alright, uh, Ao. Hey, you don't look like a worker. And you do. What's your point? Alright, what you got for us? got four Pokemon, okay. You got a Carcol. Uh, this is not the best matchup. We're a little bit weak, but we did get a Tyranitar last episode. It evolved super early. Nice shiny Tyranitar, so let's go destroy everyone. And smack down, that's absolutely fine. And we could just go for some rock slides. Wee! So far, so good. Yeah, we got a little bit kind of wrecked in the last episode. Haven't had a chance to heal up. But I don't think the town's very far from here, so we should be okay. I'm not going in against a Gerda. No way. Like one low kick or something, we are super dead. But we still got like a bunch of Pokemon left, and I'm gonna be honest, my team in this game is just. Oh! So, so good. We ain't losing. We are not losing. And Sandstorm takes you out. Nice, nice, nice. But once we um, get back healed up, gonna keep using Braxing for a little bit longer. And then we should be able to get a Delphox. And I think our team's pretty much done. Unless we find, um, you know, a new Fakemon to add to the team. We did look in the Pokedex. And unfortunately, it looks like the Fakemon our rival has, the really cool one. We can't actually capture in the wild. There might be a way to maybe get it for like a gift or something. Maybe, I don't know, at some point our rival breeds it and then we can get a free one. I don't know. We'll see. But I really want to use it because it looks so cool. We saw the second evolution of it and just, ah, oh, or I guess, would you say first evolution? I don't know. This is where it always confuses me. Like, technically it is the first evolution because... It evolved once. Yeah, would you say first evolution or would you say second evolution? Because it's in the species line, it is the second in the... I don't know. In my head, I always get confused. I don't, don't know what to say if it should be second evolution or first evolution. Because I can see an argument for both being right. But you know what I mean, right? <laughs> like it's the uh, second stage, first evolution. I guess the best way to probably say it. What would you say? I don't know. Oh, Earthquake though. Earthquake, very nice. Oh, let's go. We have some banging TMs, man. Alright, Tyranitar, you can learn Earthquake. We'll get rid of Sandstorm, because we don't need that, because we've got an ability. Oh, we are looking so good right now. So good. I'm just going to lead off with Tyranitar as well, just to get through this cave, because we're, like I said, a little bit weak. And Tyranitar should hope be able to sweep everyone. I should check the encounters as well, as well, in case there's like another fake one we can capture in here. Just in case. Alright, let me run away. Yeah, so there's one more Pokemon in here we haven't seen yet. Could be a fake one, might not be, who knows. And this, could this be the one to find out? Jangmoo. Oh, dude, I, I kind of fancy using a Jangmoo. I think next game I play where I can catch one early might have to uh to use it and my proper repellent it's like oh it's gonna be marwar right was that the first marwar we've seen i believe it might be so let me check and if it is then we'll pop a repel it's not okay i'm gonna pop a repel anyway because we might find one during a uh a battle and if we do awesome if we don't then i can just come back and try find one later on so I'm bored, let's have a battle so I can cure my boredom. It would suck if you lose though. Like if I if I was like I'm bored and I want to battle and then I lose, I'd go from bored to just like upset, mad. <laughs> like if I win, then I'd be like, hey, that was awesome. I cured my boredom, but then yeah. Risky, risky move. Actually it's not really risky because let's be honest. It's me in this game. I'm gonna win. 100 percent In green, no thank you. Alright. Oh, electric. I think that's fine with a rock slide. I'm not sure if you have levitate yet. 
Like, I know the evolution of the Levitate, but I'm not sure if it has it for its evolutions, but... Yeah. All good. And then what's your next Pokemon? You've got a Drilba! Earthquake everything! Oh, going for Dig, that's fine. Earthquake! Imagine digging and then just getting hit by an Earthquake. Oh! Does, like... Do I do more damage if, like, they go for Dig and I go for Earthquake, or, or can I just hit them with Earthquake? Like, I feel like I should do more damage, because they're underground, you know? There are some creepy Pokemon here. I don't guess enough to shop it and the, um... And the Sableye. Hey, yo, this battle will be fiery. So I'm guessing you're gonna have a Carcoal? Oh, Torkoal, that's fine. Earthquake everything! Sandstream, noise, 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 Earthquake! Nice, nice. Ah, oh, I was hoping you'd die. It's all good, it's all good. Next one finishes you off, just waste a little bit of PP. It's kind of annoying because Earthquake only has 10, but it's fine, it's fine. Hey, level 37, let's go. And Ponyta, oh, you're getting, you're getting destroyed. I feel kind of bad, like my Torrent is just absolutely destroying all the mine workers. Like, imagine just like going, oh, honey, how was, how was work at the mine today? Oh, you know, it was awful. Just doing my job and some kid comes in with a Tyranitar and just like earthquakes the place. Ruins the, like, the mine so we have to like do more work and just beat us all in battles. It was a horrible day. And there's me just like, ha ha I earthquake and destroyed everyone. Endure, that's fine, it's fine. One more. See you later. Nice. Alright. Oh, and TM for Shadow Claw. Not bad, not bad. Nice double battle coming up. So what do we have here? Looks like it's time for me to play. Can't really go for Earthquake. We've got Rock Slide, which is just as good. I mean, it's still going to be great against these two. So I go for Rock Slide, and then we go for... Hmm. Dark Pulse. Nice, nice, nice. Just don't take out my Maractus, because it could do with the experience. Ooh, that's so close by the rough skin. And Rocky Helmet. Go on, finish it off. Finish it off. Hey! Oh, like I said last episode. My Maractus is Homer Simpson when he's a boxer. Just gets hit, takes out the Pokemon. No, the Sandstorm! We lived! We just lived! Woo hoo hoo! That was kind of close, but I'm gonna Earthquake. And. Doesn't matter what I go for. I'm gonna take myself, well, take my Maractus out, but it's gonna die anyway. It's not gonna outspeed him. And I was really hoping that Earthquake would take out both of them in one hit. Oh wow, that does like no damage. I got a little bit scared there for a second. I was like, oh no, Jarable. Oh no, oh no. And then just like, yeah. Did like what, two damage? Like I say, I love, love the shiny Scolipede. So cool. Alright, finish them both off, please. Thank you very much. Nice, nice, nice. Any more Pokemon? Is that it? Sableye! And Gordor. Okay, we gotta take that Gordor out. Uh. It's a little scary. Oh, fake out. Oh, that sucks. No, this is bad. This is bad. This is bad. This is bad. Oh, you know, Gordor, didn't you? Alright, it's fine. It's fine because I can do this. I've got one revive I was gonna save, but. I think I'll just do this first. I didn't take it out. I mean, the sandstorm will do it. That's fine. You can bulk up. That's all fine. Are you kidding me? The sandstorm has to end the turn where it would just basically take out the Gordo. Oh, of course. It's fine. It's fine. Right, maybe I don't have to use the... Um, the... Revive, that was it. I forgot the word for revive for a second there. 
Might be alright. Nice. Ooh, one more finish it off. Good, good. Oh, we got so lucky. Alright, please, no more battles. Let me get to the next town, just get healed up. If there is a, um... Another battle, I will definitely heal up. I don't think that's a battle there. Okay, oh, so that's the Pokemon. Oh. Could have sworn I said yes to another repel, but... It's fine, it's fine. Uh, the outpost is over there. Great. Uh, Ayo. I've always worked here and I would never want to change job. So that's the store. I have to worry about that. And what we got here? Five Ultra Balls, okay. Hey, oh, working with Pokemon is cool, isn't it? I mean, yeah, it is. Absolutely. All right, now we're fully healed. Nothing to worry about. And we can continue on. So when you work off, when you work often, a break is required. Absolutely. I, rem I remember like, um, when in the UK, I'm not sure if it's like this other place. So I assume it must be. But when you're 16, I think actually 16 and 17, you get a longer break. So did like your 15 minute break will be a 30 minute break instead of your, I think 30 or 45 minute break for lunch, it's an hour. But um, when I was in university, I started a, a job. I think this one I was like 20. Yeah, I was 20. Started a job at this uh, retail place. And for, I'd say two months, the uh, person, my manager, thought I was, um, like 16 or 17, so they're like, oh, you get a 45 minute break, you get a 30 minute break. So I was taking longer breaks than I should have got. And it, they didn't realize I was like 20 for a long time, but oh, it's so good. That's the, that's the perks of looking young. But let's see, I was waiting for you. You see, it's our last line before the last saloon. I think it would be a good idea to practice to see if we are really ready. Right answer, so let's start training. Yeah, boy, let's do this. I wonder if the, uh, the final evolution of uh, the faking one, if it's got one. This is a good start for us. Go for a nice rock slide. Go on, go on. One shot it, one shot it. Way. Love to see it, man. And level 39. Uh, Kofalari, um... Probably safer to switch. Go for a poison tail. I'm pretty sure my Tyranitar probably could sweep the whole whole team, but yeah, let everyone else have some time to shine, you know? It's all good. Yeah, boy, take all that damage and oh, quick claw. That's, that's us. That's good. Critical hit. Can't give me the crit, crit on the, uh, the first hit, could you? That would have been, that'd been really nice. Level 40. Sludge Bomb, yes. Finally, a better poison move. And Psyshock. Psyshock better than Psy Beam. Uh, I'm not sure if it's better or not. For, for, our, for our Braxian. Well, we're going to be Delphox after this battle. Uh, Raichu, is it a Lolan Raichu? It is. Which is fine because we have a Steamroller. Yeah, boy! Oh, you think you can take me on? Think again. Uh, bug Buzz. Yes, give it a Bug Bite. Man, this is the battle where, where like our whole team's just like becoming its final form. This is so good. Uh, Maractus, let's go Braxian, go for that Psybeam. Oh, sorry, Psy Shock now. All right, Psy Shock. Not bad damage and sludge bomb. Ooh, that's doing some work. And then last Pokemon is the fakey mom. Uh, reflect, no, I'm good. Oh, I think it's got another evolution. I think it was called Pyfer Nova before. Oh, that looks so sick! Oh, it looks amazing! Oh, you gotta let me get this Pokemon, please, man. Please, we're getting near the end of the game. Well, at least to the end of the third medal. You gotta, you gotta let me have this. 
You gotta give me that Pokemon one way or another, please. If I go through this whole game and not have that, it's gonna be so sad. I'll even replace Delphox, I'll replace literally anyone on my team for it. I should probably not Kuffalari, because Kuffalari is kind of great, but... Still, I already played a lot of Pokemon for it. I love the sprite for Delphox, it actually looks really cool. Mystical Fire, uh... Let's get a Fire Spin. Nice, nice, nice. Great, now that we've trained, it's time to continue. I'll meet you at the top. All right, let's go. I should check the, uh, the encounter right around here in case there's some cool Pokemon to find. I'm just gonna run away once I get the chance. So there's one Pokemon around here we haven't seen yet. Let's pop a repel though. We'll probably find it for a battle, like we always do. Two max revives! Oh, wow. That's actually kind of awesome. I'm going to use Delphox for a little bit, and we're going to just heal up. Nice, nice, nice. Hey, yo, you look like someone who could beat me. <laughs> Good. I got Watch Hog. I want to know Watch Hog's type in this game, obviously because it's a little bit different than the usual one. Here, flamethrower. Not bad damage and Swords Dance. Okay, a little scary, but you don't have to speed me, so it's good. Nice, nice, nice. Alright. Uh, Terminator. Let's go for Earthquake, because... I don't know, Terminators, I feel like a... I got a kind of cool Pokemon, to be fair. I actually quite like the design of it. They can be a little bit scary sometimes. And sometimes they can be absolute pushovers, so, um... What one do we have here? We have a pushover. If you got the paralysis, and I'll be like, okay, he's, a, he's kind of annoying. But he didn't, so he sucks. Nice, nice, nice. Alright, what's your last Pokemon? Let me destroy you, son. Uh, payback? No, I'm good. And last Pokemon is a... Buffalan. Just a normal Buffalan. Mmm... Kofalari vs Buffalo. I think that's a good fight. Right, let's go for Dreaming Kiss. Does not do much. Oh, snap! Oh, snap! Is Buffalo gonna beat me? No, I'm the evolution. I'm supposed to be the superior one. You can't be beating me. Please, big damage, big damage. gonna lose. No! Kofalari lost to a Buffalan! That's embarrassing! I'm so sorry, buddy. You should have won that. <laughs> uh, let's go with Faraminus. Get a bit of experience for you. That sucks, man. <laughs> oh, that really sucks. Alright, so what item have we got here? We got a two hyper potions, nice. Nice, nice, nice. Hey oh! I'm not weak! Okay. Didn't say you were, but I'll be the judge of that then. Okay, you got a flag on that. It's pretty cool. Hmm. It's not the best damage. Oh, okay, you are not weak. You are not lying. <laughs> you are really not lying. Um, gonna go into for a menace because I think we should be fine. Let's go for a bug buzz. And you missed your dragon tail. <laughs> oh, sucks to be you, dude. Sucks to be you. All right. Almost level 37. Can we sweep you with Fire Menace now? And Mandibuzz. I mean, we could probably stay in. The trainers around here are definitely getting a lot stronger, though. That's for sure. I should switch, but... The special attack buff. Get rid of the confusion. Nice! 
Nice, nice, nice. One more bug buzz. Just don't hurt yourself. Don't hurt yourself. Please snap out. Snap out. Be Thanos and snap. Be Thanos and snap. I mean, got through the uh, confusion, so I'll take it. Speaking of snap, that marble snap game needs to come out. 100%. I got sent like um, a little goodie box. If you follow me on Twitter, you would have saw it a while ago. Like when the announcement of um, Marvel Snap, like the new like TCG, like online game, I got sent it. And they got sent me like um, a little poster, mug, hat, some stickers. I was like, okay, this is really cool. And then they're like, okay, we're gonna like release it. Staggered release. Still can't play it. And that was re revealed in May. And I know before, I know about it before May. It's like, come on, man. Oh, I want to play it. Look, it genuinely actually looks so good. If you don't know about it, like, look up like a little trailer. The, the gameplay actually looks really fun. And if you want to see like gameplay of it, I'll be, I'll be making videos when it comes out on the TCG channel. Turbo Volt C TCG, go check it out. We do Master Duel, Yu-Gi-Oh, Digimon, Pokemon, Dragon Ball, Final Fantasy, My Hero. We do everything. Well, no, think <laughs> maybe everything at one point. I'm trying to get into uh, Legends of Rune Terror. Rune Terror? Rune Terror, sorry. <laughs> um, the League of Legends card game. That actually is not too bad. It's just. Oh, at the moment I'm playing too much. It's, it's hard to keep up with some, like, stuff. I just wish, like. I, I can't be one of them people, but I wish I was someone that could just focus on, like, one or two games. Me, I have, I have too many hobbies, too many interests, and just, like, cutting my, my time into all this it just it's, it's hard man it's so hard like it would be so much easier if i just like focus on one thing but i just i can't I cannot do it do you know you were near the highest point in the region oh did not and now i do uh let's pop another repel ayo prepare to be crushed okay i'll get crushed uh scolpy that's not great I honestly don't know what would be the best move to go for this here. I probably should switch. Yeah, it's probably better just to switch. Uh, if we go for try and target, go for a nice earthquake. That should take you out. Poison tail. It's fine, it's fine. Noise, noise, noise. Alright, earthquake. Oh, okay, big damage. Alright, one more. I don't think we can outspeed you. Are we gonna die? Unless we live? Hey, we lived. Can't believe that. Nice. Noise, noise, noise. Alright, uh. Our scooter, uh. Wait, Barris. Does that? Does Arrow Scooter have an evolution? Is that real? I don't know. It doesn't have an evolution, does it? Arrow Scooter. Uh. Oh, it does. That's a real Pokemon. That's a real. I didn't. I. Honest to God. I did not know. One, I forgot that was a Pokemon. And two, I did not know it had an evolution. Okay, I was level 26. I legit thought that was a fakey one at one point. I... Dude. Like... <laughs> I just honestly forgot. Like, with Sword and Shield, I finished it. Stopped playing it, didn't really like it too much. Played the DLC, stopped playing it, and just, that's it. Just kind of just left it. The only time I ever popped back onto Sword and Shield is maybe like a raid or two. I just don't. Dude, I, I honest to God. For a split second, I thought that was a fakeymon. I need to go look for the Pokedex again for Generation 8, because clearly there's some Pokemon I forget existed. Oh my God. I can't believe that, it's got an evolution. 
even if it, like, it exists, like what? <laughs> oh man, that is that is insane to me. Oh, oh, the sprite for that actually looks amazing. This looks so good sprite form. Oh, I love that. Whoever made the sprite for that, like in that pose, did a very good job. Because like, I've seen some sprites where you just see the bottom, and it's like okay. But the fact they've made it so you can see the whole Pokemon, that's really cool. That is a really cool sprite. 10 out of 10. Alright. Nice, nice, nice. Wait, wrong way. Hopefully we get near the town now, because I am uh, getting a little bit weak. Eevee! I'm just gonna run though. Five Ultra Balls, not bad, not bad. Oh! And Scraggy, let me just run away. Hey, kid, okay, you want to battle? You can find very strong Pokemon around here. What? What's? What's that? That looks like um. Uh, what are they called? Secret base, hidden base. All right, let me fight you. I'm gonna go interact with that. Do you need hidden power to get to it? Is it? I forgot. How, I honestly forgot how you do hidden bases. Like I haven't not touched hidden bases since like I was playing Gen 3 when I was a kid. All right. Uh, this is not the best matchup, but it can also be a okay matchup. So let's get the sludge bomb off onto Zumaral. Yeah, boy. Take that rough skin damage. Take that rocky helmet damage. And sludge bomb, please one shot. Oh, close. Got the poison. I'll take it. Aqua Ring, that is a fine move to go for. Nice, nice, nice. At least we know we, out, we outspeed it so you can't hurt Delphox, and this should take you both out. Woo! Alright, Sludge Bomb. Russell and Kamoo! That was a cool Pokemon. We Psy Shock you and then we. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna double attack it, just make sure we take it out, make it 2v1. Iron Defense, that's absolutely fine. Oh! Bulletproof, okay. Well then. It's fine, it's fine. Uh, I probably just should switch. I'm gonna go for Rock Slide on Crossle. Or Earthquake, I don't know. We'll go for something. Nice. Good, good, good. And slash. Oof. Alright. Let's go, I guess, Flamethrower. Oh. And... Rock Slide? Nice, not bad, not bad. Alright, so let's see what this is. So a key here, okay. So we find a key, we know where to go. That just looks so suspicious. I think maybe like a legendary is in there for like post-game, maybe. If we find a key, we'll go back. Because at the moment, I think the only thing I think... If this game does a post-game, post the only thing I can think of right now is potentially that. But maybe something to do with the, the, the locked bedroom in our in our house. That was just too, too sus at the start of the game. Some things making noise in there. Not getting acknowledged. I don't like it. And there's still a Pokemon here we need to find. If I can't find it, I'll come look for off-screen. But I think we're about to get to town. Nice! Foltzy, follow me. Follow me in the saloon. Master awaits us. Okay. Before we do that, though, let's explore the town. I love Pokemon. Hey, nice. Even if the building is different, it remains an inn. Wait, okay. Alright. How long have we been recording for? Only five minutes. I think we'll take on the saloon master as well. 
Uh, there's no book that talks about the strange rock that Maxwell meditates in front of. Oh, okay. Z, 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 Z. What we got in here? Empty room. Uh, hey, oh. Maxwell spends his time meditating in front of a strange rock. I want to see this rock, man. Years ago, the region was so different. How so? How so? Uh, Mason Village is the highest place in the region. Alrighty. Ooh. It's a cool looking, like, tree. Doors locked, okay. Oh, you must be Maxwell. Welcome. I was looking forward to your arrival. I am Maxwell. Some people call me Elder Maxwell. I just prefer to be called Maxwell. And you? Who are you? I am, uh, Hanifo. And you are Voltsy. Very good, I memorized your names. I guess I don't have to explain to you what, what you came for. You're here to get your last medal, and I understand your goal. But first I will have to choose a strong opponent. I'm gonna choose Voltsy. You're so lucky, Voltsy. Come in front of me, Voltsy. <laughs> it sucks for our rival, just like, just getting absolutely disliked like that, but if I choose you, it's because you are strong and I know it. <laughs> our battle will be uh, legendary and remembered. On guard. You have a superb house, Maxwell. It'd be a shame if it caught fire. Oh, who said that? You. Bandits? Hello. I'm here just because I can. Uh, what are you doing here? You're not welcome here. You better go before I call you the, before I call the rangers. It's so sad. I was just dropping by to say hi. Well, I would say that uh, what you come to do is done. Now go away. Why should I leave? All right, I'll go call the rangers. I got it. Oh, what the? What are you doing to that rock? You know that this rock is sacred? Sorry to have damaged your precious rock, Maxwell, but trust me, it's for good of all. Now, why are you doing this? I'll call the ranger straight away. Wait, let me explain why I do that. Tell me now. It's very simple. Thousands of years ago, a dangerous Pokemon was destroying everything across the region. But one day, the brave trainers managed to defeat the Pokemon. And to be sure, oh, I wonder if it's the Oxys. And to be sure that Pokemon never came, uh, comes back, they decide to lock it in a cage. And this rock is the cage. This is probably the dumbest story I ever heard. I see you don't believe me, but I can understand that you don't believe me since this story being erased from the books. Just give me five seconds and you'll see that I'm not lying. This noise. Oh. Oh, snap. What have you done? Nothing very special. We just wake up the Pokemon. What is this Pokemon? I have, a, I have absolutely no idea. Oh, where did they go? Faultsy. Oh, snap. How did it happen? I have no idea. I'll try to find a way to get you out of there. But these flames are so indestructible. Oh, is it Moltres? Oh, Galarian Moltres, that's cool. This is the Pokemon they were talking about? I don't see what other Pokemon it could, uh, it could be. It could be. Oh, the Pokemon attacks you. Let's go. Can we capture this? Whoa, Moltres appeared. Oh, Galarian Moltres looks so sick. Alright, let me see if I can capture it. Nope, can't capture it, okay. So, Psyshock! shock. Wait, are you Fire Dark? You're Fire Dark. I forgot what type you are, um... Right. I guess the best thing to do is... Go Maractus, if we get Tyranitar out, go for like a... Rock Slide or something, we should be fine. Shadow Ball... Ouch! Sludge Bomb! Coming out speed ya! And we die, it's fine, it's fine. Tyranitar's got this. Alright, come on, rock slide, big damage. Don't flinch, don't flinch, don't flinch. Whee! Woo, half damage. And I wish we could catch this. I would totally use it. Like, I haven't really... I know, like, Generation 8 sprites are, you know, still kind of new. I haven't, like, seen or played any fan game that, um, has, like, these sort of Pokemon in it you can just, like, kind of capture, I don't think. As far as I remember, anyway. But it's nice to see, like, a fan game has a little story with these. I think it's cool. So I can't believe what you just did, Voltsy. You managed to defeat a, such a powerful Pokemon. And only like that? I mean, it wasn't that hard. You must be an exceptional trainer. 
Oh. I have this vague impression that the Pokemon is not ready to fall. Uh, you're right, this Pokemon seems ready to fight again already. Faulty, catch that. Oh, is that Master Ball? Use it on this Pokemon. Wait, oh. Wait. Did Faulty just catch this Pokemon? It seems so. Hey, we got Moltres, let's go! I'll take it. Oh, it's good on the team, 100%. Nice. Oh, it's Dark Flying. I thought it was Dark Fire. Cool. Nice, nice, nice. So after recent events, Maxwell has decided to give you the last medal for bravely fighting a dangerous Pokemon. Oh, okay. Do you also uh, decide to put your name in a book where you can be remembered forever? Ah, that must be the end of the game. Nice, man. So we'll see if this game's got any like, little post-game we can do. And if it has, we'll definitely do it. Might put the Moltres on the team. Or will that be too broken? But so far, like, real good. Like, the only thing, criticism I can say about this game is I wish I could have caught the Fakemon our rival uses. Because it, it looks so cool. And I would have loved to have that on my team throughout the whole game. But overall, really good game. Really enjoyed that. But uh, yeah, I'll let the credits roll. And then next time we will... Uh, do the post game if there is any but if not i'll catch you guys next time thank you so much uh, for watching have a great day peace